Hey, welcome. My name is Martin. I'm the creator of Super Mega Space Game. Here is Game Dev Garage. I'm making Cocos Creator tutorials in this channel. Check links in the description and subscribe to the channel to get notifications on new videos released. So, in this video, we are going to see how we can make scene transition in Cocos Creator. Um, normally, in Cocos Creator, we don't have uh, multiple scenes in a single uh, game. Uh, we can uh, load a scene and unload other scene so uh, it makes harder to make uh, scene transitions in this way so i will show you how to make a scene transition in cocos creator by using um, persistent nodes so here i have a scene and i just hit button it loads another scene so let's see how we can make this uh, here i have a uh, let me remove this one so we can create it together I have a scene here and this is uh, scene number one and this is the scene number two so I just want to uh, hit next scene and cover the screen with a uh, sprite then load scene and uh, uncover the screen again so uh, I will create a scene transition node here um, transition not just name it like that no problem so I will make it centered here I will not uh, put this node into canvas because uh, persistent nodes should be in uh, root uh, in the scene if we put inside the canvas we cannot make it persistent so we'll put here and scale it to cover the screen Let's make it a different color. Maybe like this. Okay. What I want to do is animate this uh, node from here to here. Okay. When we hit uh, load next scene button. So let's create a JavaScript here. Yes, I will call this uh, scene transition. Um, I will recreate this cover node again because Cocos crashed and reopened. Um, scene transition. Okay. I will give a color quickly and scale it. Okay, fine. So let's drag and drop our scene transition script here and let's edit this script. First, we want to make uh, this node persistent between scenes. So I will copy and paste snippet from here cc dot game dot add persistent persist root node this node that function will make this uh, node persist between scenes and available uh, in all scenes across gameplay so we already made uh, I, I already made uh, several tutorials about this topic check link in the corner for other uh, details so here uh, it makes this node persistent and I want to make uh, another function load next scene function will be called by button and that will be play our twin animation I will just copy and paste it because I don't want to lose time this will uh, make a twin animation on our node oh, sorry 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 okay uh, that will uh, animate this node to position uh, 640 and 360 uh, and then calls this dot load scene function which we will be creating here load scene function then uh, after scene loaded it will be animate uh, the, uh, it will be animated to the default position so uncovers the screen okay 
so load anime uh, load code is like that way cc dot director dot load scene here goes the scene name uh, let's check the scene name we're gonna load second scene scene trans 02 goes here yeah it seems fine let's go here and uh, put this node to default position twice for the um, 640 and let's link the button with this uh, script and we will call load next scene function here okay that's it the game play okay so I will hit next scene it will load next scene yeah this is easy and very simple you can use uh, different animations on uh, transition node for example you can make a two curtains uh, closing and opening and maybe we can try different uh, animations but it's okay it's fine for uh, this tutorial let's try again here yeah it loads fine okay thank you for watching and hope you like this video and uh, please subscribe to the channel and like the videos and share with your friends and see you on next videos bye